Despite today's decline, stocks have been fairly resilient in September. So what's next? John Trainer is chief investment officer at People's United Advisors. Thank you. Thank you, you. You say this is kind of a tale of two Septembers as we get ready to, to close out this month. How so? Correct. We, we were talking about this this morning on our investment call that August was really ha, really had the turmoil that you would normally see in September. So we really thought we had an early September last month. But with the turmoil that we've seen in the market, the turmoil that we saw today, it looks like we may be having that normal normal uh, volatility in September that we thought we uh, we had taken care of in August. And we're not finished yet. I mean, there's a lot still to come yeah. in the month of October, right? Absolutely. We've got earnings season on Tuesday. You have the 70th anniversary of the, the birth of China. So there's a, a big celebration in China. There are a lot of things going on. And, and then Brexit. October, we've got the... Oh, excuse me. Yeah, go ahead. I was gonna, I'm sorry, but Brexit no, no, is a, a, a big one right now coming up. Mm -hmm. That's right. The Brexit. You've got you've got a lot of headlines that will will keep us on our on our toes in October. So, have you made any changes to your portfolios or your clients' portfolios, given the fact that we are at a time of year which is notorious for its volatility? You know, we we made a change that we were really spending a lot of time with our clients discussing since June 30th of 2011 in our model portfolios. We have been overweight equities. We've told our clients that you, you want to be overweight, overweight equities, underweight bonds. In the last few weeks, we've basically taken that back to neutral. Hmm. So we've said, you know, we still like the market. We still want you to be invested. But we said now is not the time to be overly aggressive. So we're, we're dialing back the risk in our, in our portfolios. Where'd you put that money? We actually put it into short-term bonds. We were debating, you know, moving that into, into commodities or moving that into, into cash. But we said, let's put that into short-term bonds. So two to three-year uh, bonds is where, we, where, we're, where we're putting that cash. Uh, we will be watching. Thank you, John. Have a great weekend. John Trainer with People's United Advisors.